father's party. It's a totally not a religious party. That's in the 70s. So everybody in Lebanon was fighting Israel before it was Islamic. It became Islamic after the Islamic uh, Republic of Iran started funding it directly because they also have an ideology about Palestine. I think it's really time now, after all this, these things are happening in the world and the world is changing, and us, me, you, and our viewers, we are witnessing the change, the big change and the shift in the world from one kind of system and order to another. It is really time to start doing our own search about organizations and people. Stop buying bullies. Because there's one bully in the world called the United States of America, and this bully chooses who's the terrorist and who's not. But nobody in the history of mankind has exceeded the terrorism of the United States of America. The amount of people they have killed, whether it's in Afghanistan or in Iraq or in Africa, wherever they go, wherever they go. So it's time to change the narrative and it's time to tell ourselves, okay, who is Hezbollah? Let me go and do my research. How come Hezbollah has a parliamentary majority? Oh, there are people who voted for them in Lebanon. How come people vote for Hezbollah in Lebanon? But also Lebanon is the biggest nightlife destination in the Middle East. Because for, for us in Lebanon, for me as a Christian Lebanese in Lebanon, I am very grateful for the Islamic resistance that is fighting and protecting my well-being, my ch my children's well-being, the, the infrastructure of the country, and my ability to grow and to thrive in my homeland. So it's not really Islam, Christian, Judaism. It's very simple here. Indigenous people and colonizers. That's it. Uh, very, very, very well said. Um, now I, I'd like to talk about uh, Iran, because we hear similar things about Iran. Uh, and Iran, of course, uh, Hezbollah is certainly in the, maybe the primary force in um, Lebanon's government. But it, Iran, of course, is one of the primary adversaries of the United States, a target of the United States. And of course, Israel has, although it